earth signs this is going to be your weekly guidance um i feel someone waking up to their truth about you i feel someone like i literally see someone laying in bed and almost like coming out of a dream state like wait i can't see me loving nobody but you like that song da i happy together mm -hmm. i can't see me loving nobody but you for all my life mm -hmm. somebody is realizing your detachment to the desire of this has really helped wake someone up. I mean, detachment is powerful. Detachment is powerful. Um, I'll be right back. Let me get that. So I'm going to pull, I pulled an affirmation card. There is plenty for everyone, including me. The ocean of life is lavish with it. Abundance. All my needs and desires are met before I even ask. My good comes from everywhere and everyone and everything. So particular outcomes is what I'm feeling. Like if you were obsessed with a particular outcome or you were, oh, it has to be this person, it has to be here, it has to be now, so on and so forth. I feel that there is an awakening happening. To, um, awa there's an awakening happening within this person. I would say it could be you switch the roles, but it feels more so like for the opposite person. Your self-reflection card is, am I letting fear stop me? Are you experiencing a mountain of fear right now? Are you stalling, freezing, or ga giving up? The juicy secret is that you are the boss of fear. You are unstoppable, but it's up to you to see that by taking action. You gotta let love in. You let hate in before. You let discomfort in. You let sorrow in and you embrace them all. It's time for you to embrace love. You got trust. I feel like your ancestors are working with, with this. They're helping you. You've tried in so many ways to raise people before. Like, that didn't work. You have a partnership coming in. And worth waiting for. Things are aligning. Things are aligning and they're coming together. I'm going to pull an angel card and some tea leaf card for you guys intuition and downloads pay attention to what you are receiving rabbit too much concern with sexual matters um desire can't run you and rule you you know it, when your desire over powers your discernment and your desire overpowers your spirit speaking to you, that's an issue. You need to work on your discipline. Okay, so I also feel like you guys, uh, um, the affairs with your family card came out. I feel like someone is going to be transitioning. Could be a male. I know like this stuff is tough to hear. We're not we're not all going to live forever. And we all have to transition out of this world. And a lot of times we regret not stepping up and being present the way we wish we were or had the relationship 
So a warning or a message about something like this is an opportunity to have conversations you never got to have. I feel like you may know who I'm talking about. This person has had health issues quite a bit. But um, you've done a lot of clearing ancestrally. And as hurtful and as painful as different things are, it is as it should be. June is going to be a very big month with this. Um, so I hope this message helps. And if you'd like to book a one-on-one, -on -one, the link is in my bio. Allow yourself to use discernment on what you want to come in and what your wounds are calling in.